Hey everybody, this is Tom with Burmy Bag. So today I'm going to do a quick update on the little mammoth that we set up about a week and a half ago. Uh, I haven't given him any food since I first set it up. I did add just like a little handful of extra worms in there, so I'm definitely at the two pound mark now. I have some bedding set up here and some fresh scraps and stuff that we'll throw in there. First, let's take a peek and see how they've been doing for this last week and a half and uh, how they're liking this new system. The first thing you're going to notice is I still have some of those flying insects, so I stuck a little uh, sticky trap in here. And you can see all the little bugs I got on it. These work pretty good. Uh, the worms never get onto it. Uh, but these little bugs sure do, and so do the beetles. So it gets a little moist after a while. Right now it's pretty moist, but it works pretty good. Uh, you can see it captured quite a few bugs. And you're probably wondering what this is in the middle of my worm pen, too. It's something I've been working on. Uh, I'm calling it a water blanket. And uh, I'm trying to design something for people that are in really hot, dry areas that you can set over the top that will keep the system warm. And it'll also self-water it really, really slowly. So this has been working pretty good. I haven't quite perfected it yet, and I'm going to keep working on it. But uh, I'll do more on that later. Uh, as I... You can just grab a hold of this thing from the side. I set it on a Rubbermaid tub lid. So, zoom in. So I can see a lot of worms over the surface. Uh, they're getting pretty big. I mean, they're much bigger than they were when I first put them in here. But, you know, they're not huge worms, but they're definitely bigger than they were. I mean, a few of these over here are pretty good size now. Underneath the surface just a little bit. Man. The worms are pretty well distributed, it looks like, throughout the system. You can see a lot of castings along the side here. So they've been working the side of the system a lot. Just about anywhere I go right now, it looks like there's a lot of worms. Uh, the system's pretty moist for sure. Um, I think that bag may be putting out a little bit too much moisture into the system right now, especially with this system because this should be a pretty uh, a lot of airflow in this system because of this breathable lid and the sides of the system. So if the system's really moist right now, it means it's definitely water in it. Yeah, I mean, everywhere I dig, it's pretty uniform throughout it, it looks like. But, just plain and simple, there's a lot of worms just about everywhere. So, so I have some new bedding, and uh, take this little piece of string out of here. I'm going to add some bedding and some scraps, and they'll be set for another week. So I got some uh, scraps mixed into this bedding. I was going to feed it a while back, and then I decided not to. I wanted to wait for the video, so I just threw it in this bedding, so it's been sitting for a day or so kind of mixed in the bedding. And again, I'm not going to give them a tremendous amount right now until we, again, we get this worm population up and running pretty good and we can see how much they can actually handle. But there's a fair amount in here actually. It doesn't really look like it, but there is. A couple paper towels. I'll just throw those in there too. And just have a little bit more on the top. So I'm going to go ahead and put the water blanket back on. And just place it on here and it spreads out. It'll kind of conform to the space. Now if this was the middle of summer too, I think this would be doing great. I mean, you'd want that added moisture in there right now, the amount that this system is putting out. But it's 
going into winter now, so it's pretty cool here. So right now, I don't really need a lot of excess moisture going into there, so it's not really a good time to be testing them. So that's all for today. This is Tom with Vermibag. We'll do another update next week. Ciao.